In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to create a mood board for your brand photo shoot. Most people call them mood boards, but I prefer to call them vision boards because they really help show your vision for your brand photo shoot to your photographer. Or on the flip side, if you're a brand photographer, they can really help you understand your client's vision. In addition to our planning call, I have all of my clients create a vision board for their photo shoot so that I can make sure that we are on the same page visually. And I want to make sure you understand that you don't have to wait until you've booked a photographer to start creating your vision board. The more time you can take creating your board, the less it will feel like a chore. And if you have no idea what your vision is, don't worry. Creating one of these boards can actually help you gain clarity around what you want your brand visuals to look like. So where do we create these boards? My go-to platform is, you guessed it, Pinterest. Pinterest is amazing because you can literally dump whatever you want on there from anywhere on the internet. You aren't limited to what exists on Pinterest already. So it could be from Google, it could be from Instagram, or you could even upload stuff from your own camera roll. And if you add something to your board and you decide that it no longer suits you, you can delete it. Okay, so we're gonna open Pinterest and then we're gonna go over to the saved button. And then here we're gonna hit the plus sign to create a new board. So let's call it vision board brand shoot. You can name it whatever you want and then you can decide if you wanna keep this board secret or not. A lot of people will keep it secret until after their shoot's done, but it's totally up to you. So then we're gonna hit create and it's gonna give some suggestions for you. So if you like any of those, you can go ahead and add them. We're just gonna say done. Okay, so if you wanted to share this with your photographer, you could click here and then you can either copy a link and send it to them or you can search here by their name and then add them to your board. So to search, we're gonna click up here on the little search bar and you're gonna wanna make sure you change it from your pins right here to all pins. And then we're just gonna start with something really vague like brand photo shoot ideas. And if you pay attention to what it auto populates here, it's gonna give you more ideas for things that other people are also searching for. So let's just do brand photo shoot ideas. So you want to be on the lookout for things that really jump out at you and speak to you. So let's see. Let's say um, I love her suit here. So I'm gonna click save and it's gonna save it to my vision board. If I wanted to add a note about why I was saving it, you can click here and edit the pen. And then right here in this group, you could put a note like say, love. So in this photo, obviously she's throwing confetti, but let's say I love the dress suit idea. And I'm gonna save that. You don't have to do it for every single thing that you pin because that could get really obnoxious. But let's say you pin something and there's like something very specific that might not be as obvious as to why you pinned it, then you can make a note for that. Um, also here, you can divide your board into sections. Oops, save that to the wrong place. Sorry, Allison. Now she's gonna see that and be like, why the heck would you ever think I would wear a pantsuit? So, oops. Okay, now that we're on the correct vision board brand shoot, here there are sections and let's say you wanted to add like a, um, some of my clients, for example, do stuff in the gym and then others wanna focus on business. So let's say one, you could add and create one that said gym or business, whatever. I think that you should not worry about this right now and then go back after you've pinned a bunch of things and categorize them if you feel the need to do that. I also don't love doing that if you don't have a really strong vision for your brand already because if they're all together in one thing, like one big board that you can scroll, it gives you a better idea of the overall impression. Now, once you've done photo shoots and like you're really familiar with this process, then by all means divide things out because you have more experience and you probably already know what your brand vision is. So hopefully that makes sense. What I really want you to do is just add things as quickly as possible without thinking too much about it. So this is cute. We're gonna click here and make sure we're actually not saving it to her board. We're gonna save it to vision board. Brand shoot, okay. We shouldn't have to keep doing this over and over again once we start saving. I don't know why it's doing that. Oh, let's say we love the idea of wearing a hat. Let's double check we're on the right board, yes. Now we should just be able to start saving. Okay, let's say we're scrolling. Love the idea of sitting on the floor. See, it's gonna wanna 
tell you where your stuff goes, but make sure you're saving it to the right board. Once you have a few things saved to your board, let's just say we like that. What else do we have? Um, oh, that's cute. She's looking off in the distance with the sunglasses. Vision board. Oh, gosh, this thing is not cooperating. I have too many things named vision board. Brand shoot. Okay, now we're going to go back to our boards. So I'm just going to go back here to saved and then see my vision board. And once I have these saved, it's I can click this more ideas button and it's going to start generating more ideas similar to what I've already found. So let's get a little more specific and we're going to search up here. Remember, we have to change it to all pens. And let's search for stuff more related to my brand because that's easy. Summer photo shoot ideas. So then we can scroll and see if there's anything here that catches my eye. If you feel like you're not really getting what you want or you've kind of burnt yourself out on like the photo shoot idea thing, then you can start to search by vibe. So I love the feel of Palm Springs. So I might do Palm Springs. photo shoot. Ah, okay. So then it's telling me it's making a suggestion. Try this style airport fashion. So I'm going to make note that I might want to go back and look at that. But then I'm like, okay, here is more of stuff I like. I love this dress. It wants to put it on shoes for me and I don't want that. Vision board. Brand shoot. Oh, I love to travel. So let's say I want to use this one. Vision board brand shoot. We're going to save that there. So basically you just go through and repeat this process over and over again. It could be that you love the outfit or maybe the pose, or you just love the overall vibe that the photo gives. Sometimes stuff can start to look repetitive and like the same thing over and over again, but don't worry. We aren't adding things to our boards to copy them exactly. It's going to serve as inspiration to help us get more clear on our vision. If you're having trouble coming up with ideas, you can check out my Pinterest account. I have boards that are industry specific, location specific, some are themed, and some are created around props. You can find me at pinterest.com forward slash page major creative, and I will also add that link to the description. Like I mentioned before, you don't have to keep your searches to Pinterest only. If you happen to be scrolling Instagram and come across a photo you like, you can just send it to your board. So this is obviously a little more difficult of a task now that Instagram has kind of gone video on us. But let's say that you come across a photo like this one and you're like, oh, I'd love to do that with my business partner. So you click the three dots up here then go to share to, scroll over to Pinterest, and then select the image you want. Hit, uh, make sure it's saving to your board down at the bottom. So right here, test, and then it's gonna save for you, and that's it. Like I said before, you can literally pull anything from anywhere and link it to your board. And if it's not a good fit, just delete it. Share your board with your photographer and during your shoot, if you feel like you get a little bit stuck, there's absolutely nothing wrong with pulling your phone out of your pocket and looking at it. It's literally there to inspire you. If you like this video, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. In the comments below, let me know if you've ever made a vision board for your brand photo shoot and I will see you next time.